Hey guys, so it's me, a person. <laughs> um, so I know that this is really glitchy, the background image. It's just because my or my laptop can't really handle having like 15 different tabs open and then having to play on a server with thousands of people. That well, I mean that, and also because I need to get a new graphics card because for some reason mine is out of date. For some reason, so yeah. So, as you probably saw from the title, um, I hate, just, uh, this is just a warning to anyone who wants to play on a server, especially to, to the people, or especially to the people on Xbox, who play on Xbox, never play on Lifeboat, it is cancer, it is a horrible server, even at, like, even, because say with, with Hypixel, Hypixel at, a, at its best moments can have over 40,000 players online on one game, which, which would be Skyblock, which is what I'm playing right now, farming, but, um, and Lifeboat, at its, at it, at its worst, where it's at like 8,000 players at like midnight, even then the game is laggy as hell. It, t it, it, in normal Minecraft, you know, you can say, like, pick up a block pretty much instantly. And here, you have to wait, like, two seconds to pick up a block. And sometimes, when you break a block, it doesn't even register, so you have to break the block multiple times for it to even drop it. It's horrible. Along with, they don't tell you all the features. Say, like, say, I tried, I was modeling a cool redstone machine that would, that was cool for AFK, AFKing, in, in, in a redstone test world. And I made it in my, well, I almost made it in my lifeboat skyblock. And guess what? And, and then when I was almost done, I'm like, okay, final step. It's time to get a comparator to make this. F found out that there's no redstone in lifeboat. They never tell you there's no redstone. They, they never tell you anything. Just no redstone. Not even buttons or levers. Along with it's expensive. Like, like the Uber VIP. Like, yeah, it's 20 bucks a year, but... I mean, for me, 20 bucks a year is pretty fine. But the problem is, is because it adds in literally two features for $20. Two features. One, which is flying, which is kind of helpful. And two, which is inviting players, which is, like, helpful... Which is only helpful in one situation where you want to play with your friends. The other is just... It's just not good. Along with... The community. I hate the community. Every single time I go on Lifeboat Skyblock, there's at least ten people in the chat saying, "Invite me to your island. Invite me to your island. Invite me to your island." And and I, they're all scammers. All of all they do is just go onto people's islands, take their stuff, and leave. It happened to me. People and this was when I first came to Lifeboat Skyblock. Someone saying, "Oh, invite me to your island." I was new and was like, "I need help," you know. So then I invited them over. Took twenty-seven of my diamonds. So I just, the community, I hate it. It's way too expensive. And, and I mean, now, I know that right now it seems like I'm just going on a, just a rant about, um, Lifeboat. But I'm saying, but the main image of this is, don't play Lifeboat, play Hypixel. Now, I know that a lot of people don't have a PC, but just play on Hypixel, to be honest. It is such a good server. It has good games. It has a it has an amazing community of people that are friendly and nice and not toxic and horrible. It's just a good game. There's a lot more things. Now granted, one gripe that I have to pay about it, or one gripe that I hate that I don't like about it is because a lot of the game is kind of centered around grinding. Like you want you, you want to get fire aspect two on your sword, you gotta grind for two hours to get fifty three levels to even put it on your sword. That's not even counting getting getting the two fire aspect ones, combining them together. And at a, at, a, at an earlier level, it is really really grindy. Like even right now when I'm playing the game, it's super grindy. And as you see, I have a lapis minion to collect lapis because. Right now, some of my best enchants cost over a hundred levels just to put onto my sword. Which is insane, because at my level, a stack of enchantment bottles gets me like five levels. And so I can, I can, I can mine and attack in the slime mines for hours on end. 
and it would still take hours and hours and hours on end at a low level. And the only way to be able to get better po or better enchantment potions is by grinding to get to get your lapis level up. So there there's some bad things about Hypixel, which is of course that whole grinding thing. But overall, it's just a good server. Sometimes it is a bit glitchy, sometimes. But if you're aware of the glitchiness and know how to avoid it, it's just it's just a good server. And I know that a lot of you aren't going to believe me because of this footage, because it's really glitchy. But that's only because I don't because because my gra graphic card is out of date, and also because my computer can't handle being on a server with like forty thousand people and then having like tons of other stuff on, especially since Twitch. Don't get Twitch. For me, for some reason, Twitch just opens itself and you can never close it. Just a quick rant because I don't like Twitch. I like it as a watching platform on mobile. Okay, but yeah. So goodbye. This goes out to you. Raptor Gaming. Goodbye.